Anambra State Government has reiterated its ban on towels operated in any location within the state. Chief of Staff to Governor Chuku Masaludo, Mr. Ernest Ezajoi, stated this while speaking to some aggrieved tricycle operators who embarked on peaceful demonstration to Government House Oka. A GK Abana has details. According to Mr. Ezajoye, Governor Sulubo led administration, which is barely four months in office, is trying out measures to make life meaningful for the masses, including members of the Tricycle Riders Association. He asked them to call the hotlines provided by government to report any wrongdoing, explaining that the monthly payment of 15,000 naira amounts to less than 600 naira daily, while asking Keke riders to make sure they enroll into the system by acquiring their identity cards and other modalities. Mr. Zajogi noted that they have the option of paying 42,000 naira quarterly or 81,000 naira in six months and enjoy the rebate that comes with it, pointing out that government is only trying to generate revenue while serving the public at the same time. <laughs> Well, then you say that you said your life. You buy an article. I have to buy an article. Yes, we will do. Buy an article. All right, you can be doing on the 1st of July. You know, in one month. Government will be doing on the 17th of March. You know, you can be doing two or three years ago. And you have to be doing on three months. You know, in time. How do you have to complain? Okay? One of the Keke riders, Mr. Kingsley Abba, complained that they still pay 100 naira per passenger at every park, asking government to do their own side of the bargain by stopping every other fee in parks because it is too much for them. As for another operator, Mr. Collins Ago, government should start arresting those who still involve themselves in touting in any form, stressing that Keke riders should be in control of the union and not in the hands of people who don't ride tricycles. Also, Chidi Okorafo, who ply if it a route, explained that one of their problems lies in meeting up with payment for the higher purchase, noting that for those security operatives have chased the touts away on countless occasions, they keep coming back to extort money along that route. They asked the government to simplify the process as majority of them are poor and uneducated. In our members, um, we need number of OTI is we make an end car as we are again nature before a poor one. Yeah, man, now could you be work with people come and get us? But I want to win the number of charges we may have. Um, we need not to educate at all. Oh, no, we are not a direction. Go make the young. I get see it now. I mean, the direction. I don't appreciate that. So, for your blue. From the government house, Oka, EGK, Abana, ABS News.